Sagittarius. This is your prelude to the nitty gritty for from now until the end of November, okay? Sagittarius. Let's see what's going on with Sagittarius. I'm going to pull energy for you guys here. And then in the nitty gritty, I'll pull energy for the person that you're dealing with. And keep in mind that energies can go vice versa, okay? So if the energy here seems like it's the other person, then it probably is. And then when I pull the energy for the nitty gritty, it most likely will be yours, okay? All right, Sagittarius. What's going on for Sagittarius? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. This reading doesn't resonate for you. Then I would also suggest that you check your Moon and Rising sign as well. And your Venus and your Jupiter. Okay, let's see what's going on. Sagittarius. Let's see, guys. Five of Pentacles. Three of Cups. And the Chariot. I see some of you guys have left. Um relationships of course and where you were feeling very not appreciated in that relationship and um, looks like you guys look to your family and friends to get you through this time period that time period of you know, being disconnected from the person that, that you felt so strongly for. I see you going in a positive direction. It's like you're you're moving in stages and that's good. There's there's like great progression here. Great progression here. You're not staying stagnant. You're not staying focused on, you know, how the person made you feel or, you know, how things were when they left like you got right out there and um started doing things to make yourself feel better going out with friends talking with family talking with friends just socializing and here with the chariot you are moving forward you're striving for something new something different something better we have cancer we have taurus here I see you like embracing your spirituality here with the Ace of Cups and you could very well have like a new love interest um, but I see you loving yourself I see you really embracing that putting those whatever was bothering you about the connection, about yourself. I see you looking for something better, laying down that burden, striving forward. You know, this 10 of wands card is, is actually very beautiful. Look at that. And if you look closely, if you can see, she's got all of her wands on her back and she's got her wand that's lit up to light her way and it's like she's not even looking back she's pushing forward and she's dropping things that she does not need as she walks but she's holding on to the knowledge that she's gained on this journey because you know there is not there's not a call to um, forget you know where you came from it's for you to keep an inventory of the things that you've been through so you don't go through it again and I feel like that is what that's what you're doing like you know you're not constantly thinking about it but it's like i haven't forgotten but i'm not gonna put it in front of me and look at it no
lots of healing. You've got a lot of, of great things around you, Sagittarius, that's going on. And I really feel like you're being watched over. Like nothing can stop you is, is the feeling that I'm getting. Could be dealing with a Scorpio here. I feel like you have a lot of things going on. You have a lot of cards here that are pointing towards you, you being very spiritual. You have the Ace of Cups here. You have the star here, healing, healing energy from, from God, from the universe. You have the four, of, excuse me, the four of swords here, which is a very healing meditative card, reflective card. You have the page of cups here, realizing, walking those waters, those calming waters. The only thing that's here that is a little questionable is the Seven of Cups under the Ace of Cups. But I feel like the Seven of Cups here is not an illusion, not you being disillusioned, but more of you do have other things to focus on other than the hurt that you felt. It's like you embark, you're embarking on, you, the, the universe has opened things up for you. There are so many possibilities I feel like here for you. It's the way I feel for sure. Because I see you smack dab in the middle here. This. This is this is absolutely beautiful to me because this is your card, the Ten of Wands. And you are striving and moving forward. We have Aquarius energy, Libra energy, um, Scorpio energy here. And I think I said Cancer already. But um, we're going to go ahead to the nitty gritty and see what's going on with the other person here. Everything looks good with you. So we're going to see, pull on their energy and see what the blockage is based and um, where this thing is going, okay? So if you're interested, if this resonates for you, then uh, come join me over there, okay?